How's it going, Chip Drop? It's me, Chips, back with another episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. In the last two episodes, uh, we did the whole quest involving the Sunstone. We beat the Son of the Sun. Took a couple tries, but we did it. And then we spent, well, I spent quite a long time wandering around aimlessly trying to figure out what to do with it. But eventually, we did get a bunch of cool stuff out of it. And in this episode, it's finally time. I have procrastinated for a long- well, uh, not pro I think I could have done this before doing all these fun side quests, so you, you could call it procrastinating, but we are finally going to get Chrono back. So, let's go to the Epoch, and I believe um, we have to go to the future, back to uh, the Protodome, I believe it's called. Uh, because if you'll remember, many, many episodes ago, there was a dude there, one of the wise men, I forget exactly which one, he told us that we had to go, Keeper's Dome? Maybe it was the Keeper's Dome. Um, that we had to go get the doll of Chrono, the Doppel doll, and we did that a while ago. Uh, so now we gotta, I'm assuming, come back and just tell him, yo, we got it. Um, I don't... Oh, maybe this is it. Maybe this is it. Maybe not, I don't remember. Death Peak harbors a power capable of restoring the slain of life. But the power to reverse death is not an easy one, uh, not one easily invoked. The need must be great, and the person's existence of utmost importance. And what's more... You'll need a double, a doll identical of the person in every detail. Then, and only then, will the power deign to hatch the egg. Yes, that'll do quite well. I love how Balthazar's voice is literally just me. All the other ones I gave some crazy voice, and this guy's just totally normal. Because he's a, he's a little, uh, little Chia Pet looking guy. Uh, it seems the time has come for you to attempt Death Peak. Is, uh, it is the only chance you have of reviving your friend. I've implanted one final program. Truly, I mean this, I mean it this time, in this construct's memory banks. It will help you, or help to guide you up the mountain. Please stand back. Can we finally go in there? Oh, it's one of these weird guys. Executing program! Okay, so there are, are there gonna be a bunch of these guys on the mountain as we climb up? Showing us where to go? The three entities you just saw will aid you on Death Peak. This ends my message. Now, I ask you for a favor. This construct has reached the end of his final program. Please, let him rest. The switch is on his stomach. I gotta switch them off? Switch the construct off. Alright. So, we have a path before us. Now, the thing I don't exactly remember is which age Death Mountain is in. I think it's in the Middle Ages. If I remember. Or maybe it's in every age? Is this it right here? Oh. Death Peak. Okay, never mind. And here they are. Walk when the wind dies down and hide behind trees when it picks up strength. Okay, okay. Obtain oh. a strength capsule. Oh, what? You can't hide behind that little ledge? Okay, okay. Oh, there's a tree right there. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe we can't do it in this age because there's no trees. Maybe? That's my work in theory right now. Can't do it now. There's no trees. We gotta go back. Is it in the present? It's like right in the middle. It should be. 
right there, but I don't want to... No. It is not it. It's definitely in the Middle Ages, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> definitely, I am sort of positive. Okay, is it this? Magic cave. Oh, maybe it, that is the only one. I could have sworn that it was like Death Peak was always there, but maybe not. Yeah, okay, okay. Maybe I'm just, uh, just wrong. I guess we can check. No, it's definitely not in prehistory. All right. I was wrong! We must figure out a way... Here. How do I hide behind a tree when there's no tree to hide behind? Walk when the wind dies down and hide behind the trees when it picks up strength. Can I... Oh, can I go down? No. Huh? Huh? You are not helpful, sir. Uh, there's a tree over there. Can I get up on that ledge? I'm thoroughly confused. Okay. So far, this is not going well. Do I go switch the guy on again? Uh, I don't know. This is the only tree I can find, and I can't go behind it. Why don't I just go right here? Oh! I thought for sure that little area with the strength capsule... Where I had to go. Look. How does the wind blow me over here? How? Huh. Maybe. I think Joshua mentioned the Proto Dome, but maybe that's what this is. Keeper's Dome. I'll look. I'll look around. I'll look around. Abandoned sewers. No. Ares Dome. No. Uh, this could be Banger Dome. That's not what it was called, but that's what I'm calling it. Tran Dome. I think it's probably like in the original, the Keeper's Dome was called the Proto Dome. Uh, Black Omen, we don't want that. Unless it's this Proto Dome. Oh, so the Proto Dome is a place. Oh, this is just this. Never mind. So it was the Keeper's Dome. Huh. So how do we climb this mountain? Let's figure it out. When the wind dies down, I'll walk when the wind dies down and hide behind trees when it picks up strength. There's no trees to hide behind. What? Because I kept getting blown away while he was talking? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh! Okay, okay. All right. Come on, yes. All right, Chrono Trigger. I see you. Is there okay? The wind seems pretty normal here. Are these items? No! Blood yoke? Oh! Well, they're getting bodied. But they are fast. 
Oh my god, Frog is just going in. Frog is fed up with these blood yokes. Wow, they are very upsetting to watch. Oh, we just got another dual tech. I wasn't looking at what it was, though. Yo. These chests are well hidden. Alright, remember to go down there. Alright, blood yokes. Oh, so the crit doesn't kill it. Good to know. How much does... Still, okay, so we still want to just use magic with Luca. I don't know if her weapon increases her magic abilities. Uh, I hope it does. But if not, you know, it's alright. Because that was just like a, a gimme. Oh! And one of these guys. Yo, I should try a water too. And a laser spin. And a fire too with Luca, if need be. Nope. Need not does not be. Alright. Let's uh get some cure beams up in here. Just get everyone nice and healthy. And let's keep on keeping on. Is this... Nope. Alright, it's been a while since we've been in, like, a dungeon. Well, the Geno Dome was a dungeon, so never mind. It hasn't been that long. Alright. This is exciting. We are getting Chrono back after all this time. Technically, this is still a side quest, I have heard. You don't need to get Chrono back, but let's be real. You gotta get Chrono back. So we are like, oh, you know what I should do? I'm realizing we gotta put Marl in the party for this segment. And, and Luca, to be honest. We'll, we'll rock with the OG3 for now. Because, you know, Marl and Luca, they started it all with Chrono. They gotta be here when he comes back. Oh, a save point. I almost didn't see that in the snow. Alright. Let's snag this. Barrier. We are getting all sorts of rings. Oh, up there. I want that. I want that. Oh. Lava spawn. Okay. Okay. Alright. Um. Let's get a cure 2 on Luca. Please don't kill Luca. Alright. Alright. Well, we did just save. Oh, you know what? You know what? Double cure. So we don't die again. Oh, I gotta check everyone's equipment. Uh, mostly Luca's equipment, because she was not here for the Son of the Sun battle. So she might not be up to snuff. Uh, and I'm guessing she's not up to snuff, because she died. Immediately. Alright, alright. So they caught me off on guard a little bit. Lavo spawn. Sleep. Oh no. Alright. Um. Oh, there's two of them. Shell count. Oh! Don't attack the shell, attack the dude. Got it. Got it. Well, I attacked both of them. Oh, the shell is immune to magic. So whenever you attack the shell, it does this, which is no good. 
Luke is dead again. And Frog is confused. Oh. Not that. Oh, Frog's not actually confused. Alright, let's get the double cure. Just so we don't die. And then we will, once they're back. What's going on? Yo, oh, you can do that anyway? It's no fair. Alright, we are going to use an Athenian water, and then we are going to... I'm going to try heal. Because Marl is also a bit low. Okay, not bad. Not great, though. Not great. Thank you for not attacking Luca. Okay, okay. Let's get a cure two. Uh, we can do one on Marl as well. And then I'm gonna do a regular fire. So we don't attack the shell and it can't counterattack. Cause that's what's giving us problems. Okay, now we're good to go. Bad, not bad. Let's aerial strike the face. Let's just ice the face. Throw some ice in your face. All right. Oh my god. This guy is a. Uh... He's no joke. This is just a random dude. He's probably a mini boss. Oh, there we go. We just attack the shell now? Okay, the shell's nothing. Okay. Antipode something? I couldn't read what that said, but. Oh, an arm for Robo. Like that, but. Okay. Um, prevent stop and slow. That's pretty good. Yeah, this is just straight upgrades. Uh, this is a straight upgrade. Okay. Should I look at... I'll look at the arm for Robo. I mean, he's not here, but... Yeah, not as good. Not as good. Okay, let's heal people up first. Um, let's get some heals. Is that the most ef efficient way of doing it? I don't know, it was pretty efficient. Alright, we're outside. This reminds me, and I think... It, oh, the Brave Sword. I doubt it's better. Yeah. Um... This place reminds me of the Mountain of Woe. And it might actually be the Mountain of Woe. Because that fell into the ocean. But it might be like it came back in the future. Play tectonics, moving around and stuff. Um, just it looks aesthetically very similar. And I'm thinking it could be the, the same place. Maybe not though. I'm sure we'll find out. Okay, can't get over there yet. Oh, we're doing a little... A little loop around, I see. Oh. Or not. Oh, it was a switch. Interesting. All right, these guys are back. That's fine. A little water too, a little ice too. Uh, and we need some more MP on Frog. After that little mini boss, but it's all right. Frog getting a level. Love to see it. Love to see my man Frog getting a level. All right. So now we go back around. Are these people gonna show up again? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. This ain't so bad. Feels good when you can just, uh, you know, go through a place. See, if I hadn't done all these side quests yet, uh, and I didn't have all this sick gear, this wouldn't be as easy. Oh, we got a rise. All right. That would have helped us quite a bit in the Son of the Sun battle, but we made it. So it's all right. We got it. Oh, these two idiots want to show up. All right. Whatever. Bam. Getting ice too. Luca is literally just chilling. She does not have to do anything. Alright. Let's go in here. Oh! Uh, the Hadian Sickle. That seems like a Magus weapon. Oh, wait, no, this is not the right... Dude, Chrono is going to show up and Magus is here. He's going to be like, what? What happened? All right, just go around that guy. Oh, we got another one. All right, now that we know what to do, it shouldn't be as tough. Just get the face. He's still doing his needle thing anyway. Uh, let's cure to Marl. Luca will hopefully not die. <laughs> hopefully. Fire. Alright, uh... I will... Does Frog have a better move than- oh no, his uh, his other one is, like, if Frog is low, it does a lot of damage. Which he is not at the moment. Yo. Oh, just for that animation, the, like, wind goes away. Is this supposed to be snow? There's, like, icicles and stuff, but it could be just, like, ash. I could see either one being the case. I'm gonna haste. Oh, oh Luca, Luca's asleep. Love to see it. Okay, never mind. Hasting frog, not gonna happen. Alright, got an elixir. Luca got a level. I don't know how far I should keep going. Okay, okay. What does this guy have to say? The footing here is icy and slick. Be careful. Fall and you'll have to start over. Huh. All right, well, this seems like a good as place as any to end off the episode right by the save point. If you guys did enjoy, as always, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Tune in next time, because we are going to keep on climbing this mountain. We're getting Chrono back, unless I keep falling off that cliff about 100 times, which will probably happen, let's be real. Uh, but regardless, as I said, we're in the end game now, so you got to tune in next time to see what happens next. I will see you guys then, but until then, don't forget to take it easy. Oh, I bumped the mic right at the end. Great.